This week, anti-poverty activists have been protesting daily outside one of the downtown east side's newer restaurants, Pigeon. The area is known as one of the poorest postal codes in Canada, and protesters are saying that over the past couple of years, the area has been built up with pricier restaurants going in. The protesters say that the restaurants are pushing them out, but for some reason they've only decided to pick it outside of Pigeon. Co-owner of the restaurant says that the protest can make some of his clients uneasy, so he's been doing what he can to create a welcoming atmosphere. When the protest started, uh, you could feel that it was tense when you walked in, especially when they were getting more and more aggressive with the clients. And so, uh, you know, we had to work on ways of, of making people, when they came in here, felt like a sanctuary of some sort, so that it wasn't, so people could actually switch over, so that the room wasn't tense. You know, it's simple as kind of like lighting and music, and the way that you, you greet people, and, you know, and, and try and lighten the mood about things, you know. And rather than sit there and, and uh, deny what's going on outside, sit and have conversations with everybody about, about what is going on and, and, uh, and why. So I decided to see what a night dining at Pigeon is like. If you get there before the protest starts at 6, it's like dining at any other restaurant. But as the night progresses, you can slowly see them gather. An army of shadows soon appears through the frosted glass that Grosuti put up to combat the distraction from protesters. So I never wanted to black this out, but when I've got, or not black, but put the vinyl up, when you've got people that aren't respecting your property and aren't respecting your guests' privacy by, by camera phoning them and videotaping them inside your restaurant or flashing lights in front of their eyes, you know, we had to do something. He definitely creates a welcoming atmosphere with great food, but it's no mystery why some people would feel uncomfortable leaving the restaurant amongst a throng of demonstrators. But it's still unclear why they're only targeting Pigeon. Pigeon restaurant is a line in the sand regarding gentrification in the downtown east side because a lot of things are much, much le less expensive east of here and everything is being gentrified in a big way west of here. I guess basically our communities have enough. For the province.com, I'm Larissa Kahoot.